Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Nest. In this video, I'm gonna do a quick shoes review. It's not really a shoe, it's the boot review from brand A6, the Gel Quantum 360 Chelsea boot. And as usual, I'm gonna share with you guys my three different looks I create to go with this boot. Let's go. So this is the pair of Chelsea boot from ASIC brand. It's the collaboration between ASICs and Takashi Roshi Ya. A few moments later. Shita, the soloist. Hopefully I pronounced that name correctly because it's really long and it's in Japanese. The material that they use on this is pretty nice. In my opinion, it's really like shine. It's a polished leather. However, I feel a little bit kind of toughness, kind of rough feeling when I wear on this shoe. I think that's how you support to feel when you have the upper material of this boot. It's made out of a polished bladder, so often it takes time for you to break it in. I never really a fan of polished leather in the first place because polished leather is look good when it's brand new, but when it get aged, it can start to crack and wrinkle. And um, this boot to me though, I think if you are tired of classic traditional Chelsea boot like leather also, then I think you should give this boot a try. On this tooling from ASIC though, they call it gel quantum 360. So usually when you call it 360, it's the gel that go all the way from the lateral side, right? Go all the way to the medial side. That's why it's 360, the gel technology. Um, when I put these shoes on, I feel like comfortable for sure. More comfortable than the, the traditional leather Chelsea boot. Um, when I look at this Chelsea boot uh, on the internet, I can't really see a lot of detail, you know? However, have it on my hand again, you know, everything that you get to look closer and you can find out more detail of uh, this uh, boot. Um, first, let's talk about uh, the pattern, uh, how they cut the pattern on this Chelsea boot. At the side, on the top of this pattern, you can see there's a raw edge. However, the raw edge is not on the ankle area. They turn and then they stitch, so make the edge is cleaner because they fold the edge around the elastic band and uh, um the design aesthetic on this boot though i'm not really sure about this kind of pointy edge around this elastic band you know but when i look closer into the tooling the geometric shape that on the design aesthetic of the gel also in the outsole i was like hey that makes sense because they want to go flow together every single detail on this upper does not really have a lot of patterns or a lot of detail you can do on this classic Chelsea Blues inspiration but at least they pull out this detail you know connected to the outsole tooling and in the lateral side you can see there's a tiny ASIC branding on the top of the collar and in the back of this heel counter they use suede texture accents um, this is not really the suede leather it's more like man-made material on this and go to the outsole tooling of these shoes is the gel quantum 360 from ASIC so you know it's a gel technology go all the way from the lateral size to the medial size often you know you don't see this kind of tooling go with this a uh, classic uh, Chelsea boot pattern I feel pretty a little bit tech wear techy look a little bit and also kind of futuristic as well onto the tooling of this also, um, this also is have the same aesthetic geometric shape also pattern go together with this uh, midsole and also the pattern on this upper. Um, in the middle of this also, they have a plastic plate so prevent the shoes from twisting. It's very technical 
uh, also tooling like a pair of running shoes from A6. However, the upper is very minimalist, very classic JLC boot. I really appreciate this model because I'm bored with the classic. I mean, the classic, nothing wrong with the people that wear classic shoes. The classic is JLC boot. But to me, like, I want to see more. Like, what can you do, you know, design wise? Not just like, okay, the quality of this JLC boot is great. Then what next? At the designer perspective, I want to see more than just a regular JLC boot. So this is a great design. Uh, the pricing on these shoes is 280. It's a little bit expensive, but it's the collaboration and also the leather upper on this JLC boot is also there's a price on it as well. You know, often A6 branding they use really like patent leather or really um fake leather but this one they use real leather that's it it's already a elevation there you know on the material wise and the shape on these shoes though again i feel like a little bit narrow however they got inspired from the slick jersey boot from the beetle back in the 1960s so after I found out the story behind this, I was like, okay, that's nice. Maybe because I keep seeing the trend like bulky, chunky, oversized shoes. That's why when I look at these shoes, I feel like a little bit discomfort because uh, of the shape of this Chelsea boot. Love the tooling and also glove plastic Chelsea patterns on this upper. It's a great combination, comfort, innovation on this also tooling with the traditional classic Chelsea boot and I want to complain about this I don't know why I bought these shoes from A6 though the box the packaging is just messed up like this I don't know like what the hell is broken crack the box is just crushed FedEx gotta do better than this I don't know it's just very bad um, shipment from uh, FedEx because I hate when I see my box like this you know what if someone like want to keep perfect box this is not a perfect box for sure and the sizing on this boot is fit to two side and styling with this boot basically whatever you wear with a pair of skinny jeans or whatever you wear with your traditional jersey boot you can go with this but to me I want to see a little bit techy look on the clothing when I wear with this pair of techy jersey boot you know it's a great jersey boot it's lightweight too it's not that heavy as well you know often when you wear a pair of leather Chelsea boot is kind of heavy trust me especially you pay for the good quality Chelsea boot they are slightly heavier and up next I'm gonna share with you guys my three different looks I create to go with this boot
So there you go. This is my quick shoes review, Chelsea boot review from the collaboration between A6 and the Solarist. I think it's a great Chelsea boot. I love the combination between innovation technology on the tooling with the traditional pattern Chelsea boot on the upper. Um, it's a great uh, shoe and I would recommend people to give it a try. And also it's very comfortable too, you know, not like your traditional Chelsea boot that with leather outsole. That one often is not comfortable. And if you like one of the look in this video, give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel for more video. I have a lot of video coming up every single week and I can wait to share with you guys. I'm out.